Drinking too much of protein can spoil your kidney. Is it a fact or a myth? Hi, my name is Dr. Benedict, a medical GP and also a bodybuilder. And one of the most common questions I have received is, will protein destroy my kidney? From a medical perspective, the answer is yes and no. But before we go to the further details, you will have first have to understand more about protein. Basically, protein is an essential macronutrient that is found throughout our body, in our muscle, bone, skin, hair, and also all around our body part and all tissue. It makes up the enzymes that power many chemical reactions and also hemoglobin that carries oxygen in our blood and also in our body. There are at least 10,000 types of different protein. But what is more interesting is that protein is made from over 20 basic building blocks called amino acids. Just because we do not store amino acids, our body creates them in two different ways, for either from scratch or by modifying other amino acids such as histidine, isoleucine, lysine and also other essential amino acids which also come from food. So back to the question, will excess protein destroy your kidneys? Most often, it will not have any effects unless you have an underlying kidney disease. For regular people, adding more protein to your diet may increase the kidney's workload a little, but it's quite insignificant compared to the amount of work your kidneys are doing every day. And if you have kidney problems, you, have, you can always consult with your doctor or dietitian before consuming any protein. And just for your fact, additional protein is always excreted throughout our urine if there's any excess protein intake. But of course, it is always important to pick the right brand of protein. There are many imitations of fake proteins out there in the market that provides zero nutritional value. So, if you want a peace of mind, you can always choose MMX brands, MMX Isoline or MMX Whey, which provides amazing high quality protein. Best of all, it is GMP and also halal certified, so you can use it without any worries. As for how much protein you need in a day, and also the method to consume protein that will be in our next topic so stay tuned and see you again